friends, talking hands. Whoopie doopy doopy. <laughs> How are we all? Are we all okay? Well, it's really windy and whatnot outside, so what a better way to spend a bit of time in our bedrooms, hey? So, what I want to show you today is some items that I've had from AliExpress.com. AliExpress.com, all the details as normal will be in the description box underneath the video. Okay, so without further ado then, let's have a look at this first item that we've got. First item then, now I will apologise and say to you that I've had camera issues. There is a couple of items that have been opened. Camera went, uh uh, no. So I've had to restart the video. So let's have a little look then. I'm going to widen you out just a wee bit. There we are. So in this kit, I ordered this kit with children in mind. We've all got grandchildren, young children that want to have a go at beading if they see mummy and daddy doing a bit of beading. So that's what I had in mind when I ordered this kit. It comes with some little bitty scissors. Look at those super cute little scissors. I don't know how sharp they are. They It does come with some Crystal Tech 0.5mm elastic cord. Here we go, so they've made this kit with elastic bracelets in mind. Let's just have a little snip with these scissors and see if they're sharp. Yes they are, so if you are going to be using this with little fingers, make sure that you supervise them, okay guys? So there we are then, we've got some little scissors and some um, Crystal Tech 0.5mm elasticated cord. Okay, so let's have a little look then at this box. We've got a lovely box. It all comes all complete so they can have a little stash wherever they want it. Nice clip, nice and tight. Let's open the box. Like I say, I did already open these two, so do forgive me, but I will show you. So if they wanted to put their name on, they can put the name on with these lovely little lettered beads or they can put a little message or um, their initials whatever they want to do now these little things are made of Fimo Ooh, dropping one little Fimo beads that have been precisely cut they're about one millimeter thick I would say okay guys so we've got lots of different colors all the colors of the rainbow and we've got some little shell beads. Let's take a little close look at these, shall we? Have a little closer look. Oh, well, I think they're supposed to be like that, so you can see the inside of the shells. And they've got. Let's just put those in there. So you'd have to thread these through one end. Uh, they don't look as if you can thread them on. You'd have to thread them through the shell at the top. Does that make sense? Some of them... No, you can't get the thread all the way through. Do you know what I mean? So, let's just have a look. That's a shame. We'd have to use these in something else. No, there's no hole to thread them through to keep it on, unless, no, there isn't even a way of wrapping, wrapping it on. So, unfortunately, the shell beads have no direct holes that we can use to um, actually get on the thread, which is a shame. But we could possibly use these for something else, a bit of wire wrapping or something. So that is a shame, never mind. So we've got all the colours there, the FIMO, the shell bees that are no good. But we've also got these little, now are these metal or, or are they acrylic? Let's have a little look. They're acrylic. You can tell that by feeling them. metal. I think they are metal guys. Yeah they are metal. Yeah they are metal. 
little sea beans that's obviously got in at the factory. So some little beads that you can put in between their beads. We've got some little dangly charms, some starfish dangly charms. Let's have a little see if the metal or acrylic. Yeah, metal. Chomping in between my teeth. So they could put little starfish, dangly starfish charm on their electric on their elastic. Oh, they're quite nice these are actually. You could always steal them. <laughs> steal them and put them on some bracelets of your own. <laughs> I wouldn't do that, no. I have no grandchildren that are interested in jewellery making, which is a shame. But I, I got this, like I say, is in mind for you guys to take a look at. Some little stars. I will even do a little video for the youngsters if you like. And what are these? Oh, wow! This is a bag of um, findings. Let's get the little scissors. Look how short they are. Like I say, do make sure that you supervise, guys. Wow! Little jump rings, little lobster clasps. Lobster clasps, little jump rings. Everything needed to get the little beader going. Some little clots or clamshells, whatever name you call them. Wow, I'm really impressed with that. How many do you, you get? Loads. One, two. Three, four, you get loads, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, I think you get ten, ten, no you get more, ten, eleven, Well, bear with me, 13, 4, you get about 15 or so um, lobster claws. Well, wow, this is great. So everything needed, you could even pinch some of these guys, couldn't you really? Little Christmas gift ideas or birthday gift ideas. The little beader, wow, that's really good. I'm really impressed with that. Who knew? Who'd have thought it? So there we are then. So that's our first item. I'm really impressed with that. Just leave me a comment if you'd like me to um, if you'd like me to do a little video for children with children in mind, and I will do my best. So the next thing up then, guys, is. This little kit. So you don't get any thread with this, but you do get, and that's sealed, so let's open this. You get a pack of needles, we'll have a look at those in a second. And this I got with stringing in mind. So all in an amethyst colour. You've got hearts. Nice amethyst hearts. All faceted as well. And the glass. Look at the sparkle on that. Wow. Some little um, round beads. Faceted round beads. I'd say they were about 4mm. 
you get some faceted bicones. You get some larger faceted round beads. So they were probably about a six, maybe eight mil. Look at these. Some drops, crystal drops. Some small three mil, I'd say, bugle beads. And some sea beads. These are the craft, they aren't a uh, branded sea bead because I can see that um, the different sizes. But hey, and a pack of needles. So let's just have a look at these needles then, see if I can work out what sizes they are. You get a big eye needle, a large big eye needle, a small big eye needle. And when I say big eye, I mean that um, they are, they are, so you can see. Wow, are they all big eyed? Yeah, another big eyed needle and another medium size. Yes, they're all big eye, uh, big eyed needles. Wow. So a bit of bead stringing in mind for them then guys. But what a fabulous kit. Big eye needles. Still can't get over these. These are beautiful. And obviously you can mix them with your own um, stash that you may have. Or separate the colours using your seed beads. We'll come up with something for that guys and um, we'll do a nice little tutorial on a bit of stringing maybe. We'll see. We'll see what I can come up with. And again, nice little box to keep everything together. Because sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. And your big eye needles. So again, that's a nice kit. Put that out of the way. Next up then is some um, metal spacer beads. These look nice in between um, those purples. Again, comes in a nice box, nice handy box. All individually bagged as well, so nothing gets lost. little space beads, flower ones, gorgeous. These in all in a like a antique silver effect. So I always call these wool wool balls. <laughs> Just look like um, balls of wool. ones. And you get a real fair amount guys. Nice and heavy. Little barrels, decorated barrels. And how handy to have um, them all in a nice tub to keep everything together. You can reuse the tub after, order some more and reuse the tub. Some more decorated barrels. Wow, oh, you can get loads. Some little saucer beads. All metal. Oh, them are really cute. Wow. Some more 
more sauces. It's gorgeous. Really nice. So I'm really impressed with that so far. AliExpress. Nice. So next item up then guys is this kit. And I ordered this with guys in mind. Um, and you get all this in the kit. Okay. <laughs> and these are all wooden beads. So let's have a look see first then. At this one. Let's just move that out of the way and we'll have to look at the beads in a second. So you get some tools with this. So you get some, um, let's just open this bag quickly. Some tweezers, plastic tweezers. And this is a jump ring holder, so you hold it on your finger and it's for opening jump rings. So you can put it on whichever finger you like and that opens jump rings, different sizes. Jump ring holder, some little plastic tweezers, maybe for pulling your threads through if you're in a tight spot. And some long nose pliers. So you're all ready to get going. In this kit you also get, just put that out of the way, some more little dinky scissors. <laughs> and um, some more uh, Crystal Tech, your elastic cord in a 0.6. And even smaller scissors. I don't know if these are sharp. Let's have a little look-see. No, they aren't as sharp as, um, well, they aren't. Oh, no, I'm a pretty useless, but hey, these little pink ones are okay. Yeah, so some 0.6mm um, crystal elastic cord. And then this kit, wooden beads, all wooden beads. Like I say, I got them with guys in mind. Because we don't always make a lot of um, men's jewellery. Well, I certainly don't. So I thought, push myself a little bit. Ah, uh, now these are not wood. These are acrylic. But once they're on a bracelet, you wouldn't know that they weren't wood. But they are acrylic. We've got some... What are these? Sure, but they are. What does it say on the box? Wood bead spacer can be randomly matched. Ah, okay. So the spacers are wood, and then you've got acrylic beads, and then some glass beads. But they to me look like lapis. Look at these ones, are these? Um, yeah. You don't have to do elasticated bracelets for guys if you don't want to. You can still use, um, what do they look like? Lab dry to me. Some flashes in it, I'd say they were lab, lab, lab durite, which is my favorite gemstone. Can you see it flashy? So, like I say, you don't have you can use cording, um, what's the other stuff called? Cotton thread. So, I'll take these wooden beads. 
say I bought this with guys in mind. Little wheels, wooden wheels. Spaces. Got loads. What are these? Ah, oh, these are lava beads. You could do macrame with these. Lots of ideas, guys. Lots of ideas. Guys for the guys. <laughs> Little lava beads. They're great. You get loads in here. These are lot of, these are lava beads as well. Get them up. Slightly bigger, so I'd say they were six mil. Maybe, oh, I'd say there was six mil. I've got a bead measure somewhere. You saw the state of my bead room, I've still not tidied it up. All the beads. Gosh, there's loads you can do with this. Lava beads, lava beads. What are these? Smooth glass beads, all dark colours for the guys. Yeah, glass beads, black glass beads. I'll lose one. Caught it in my legs, we're okay. More wooden beads. So you could do macrame or macrame, whichever way you pronounce it. Look at those, so cute. I hope the camera's picking them up, how cute they are. Oh, what a fabulous kit! Not much for the scissors, I think they could improve on the scissors. I think I'll just bin those, but. Those little pink ones are okay. And then what a fabulous kit. Like I say, you don't have to do stretch, but why not? You can do stretch, it's there. Well, and it even gives you a little bit of inspiration on the box. I'm loving that. Thank you, AliExpress. Loving it so far. So we're on to the last two items then, guys, that I had. Um, so we can see that this all comes together. Let's just cut that off. In gold, and we have some gold wire. Take that off a second. Let's just open this as well so we're not messing around. We can get straight onto it and have a little look see together. with that so I know what came with what. Okay so in this bag then we have some 0.3 millimeter um, copper wire that's gold colored wire wrapping. We have oh I love bald hat pens these are my ultimate favourites. We have a pack of gold bald head pins. Now these are nice and fine, so you can do wrapping around beads. Make some nice wraps. I love these are my favourite. Look, you've heard me go on. I don't know how many times on my other videos how much I love a bald head pin. You get a pack of um, plain head pins. And these are really nice quality actually. Nice and thick. I know you're all dying to see what's in this box now, aren't you? So, bald head pins, flat head pins, some copper wire. And let's have a look see what's in here. 
Right, we've got some little tiny um, 3 mil, I would say 3 mil pearls. We've got some 4 mil, I would say, pearls bag. We've got some 6 mil and some 8 mil. I'm sure these are 8 mil. Little pearls. We've got a bag of Um, extender chains in gold and they're about two inches extender chains we've got some ear wires about ten pairs I'd say one Uh, yeah, I'd say 10 pairs. 10 pairs of ear wires. Oh. This is nice. We've got some... Um, and you get the backs with them. I'd say 10 pairs again. Put my divider back in. Let's have a little look at these ear wires together, earrings together. So we've got a bald with a little loop on so you can make some danglies and they also come with backs. So you pop your back on like that. Aren't they great? <laughs> Loving this. We've got some chain. Gosh. I'd say a couple of meters. Yeah, definitely a couple of meters of gold colored chain. We've got another bag of um, head pins, thick ones. We've got some hair accessories. So you could do wire wrapping, wrapping your pearls around. Crocodile clips these are called, aren't they? For your hair. So we've got a bag of larger ones. How many have we got in? Uh, four. So you can make four large hair accessories. And a bag of small ones. How many do we get in here? Two, four, six of the smaller crocodile. Hair grips, hair slides, hair accessories, all ready to be um, decorated. But we've got some hoops. Some smaller ones and some larger ones to make hoop earrings. Of course, you can make um, so it takes out like that. Goes for your ear that way on, and then clips on the back like so. So some nice dangles off. You could decorate with seed beads and do some dangly bits. Anyways, can't get over this. And some head um, jump rings. Gosh, 
nice bag full of jump rings. I'll say five, maybe six mil jump rings. A fab little findings pack. They are fine, these jump rings. They aren't the uh, massive strong ones. quite strong actually and then we've got a bag of lobster clasps it's about 20 so in there and um, one, two, one, two, and five toggle toggle clasps Go over this, what a great little um, kit. If you know somebody who's just starting to get into jewellery making and you want to get them a little gift, what a fab idea this is. All the findings that they'll need with, with a few bees to get them started. Look, that's absolutely fantastic. And the um, box to keep everything together and everything safe. I need to take them out of the bags, guys, don't I? I'll do that in a minute. So, nice findings box. And I have it in gold, and I also have it in silver. I just want to quickly have a look just to make sure that um, it's the same. And we'll have a look together. Oh, in this one you get um, some eye pins. So we get some gold. It would have been nice if it had been silver uh, beading wire, but hey. 0.3mm gold coloured beading wire. We've got some eye pins. In silver. Nice loop at the top. Nice and long. They've got to be 50mm I'd say. Let's have a little one. Come on purse. Let's put you in centimetres. Oh, 60. So, 6 centimetres. Those are guys which equates to two and a quarter inches, two and a quarter inch eye pins and that'll be the same on the gold as well, they'll be the same size. We've got head pins, a bag of head pins. Oh, my favourite, bald, oh, bald head pins. And let's have a little look see in here then. So exactly the same as the gold. We've got some nice little pearls in varying sizes. Um, extender chains, ear wires, and um, the studded ones. Some nice silver jump rings. Oh, and, oh, here's a little bit different then. We've got some smaller head pins, oh, some smaller bald head pins, and some smaller eye pins. Fabulous. Oh, I'm loving it. And some chain, nice silver chain, about two meters, I would say. Ear hoops again in two different sizes. These look nice with just a bead on and a on a wrap loop with a large bead and maybe a smaller bead either side. Nice idea. These little ideas come to you don't they while you're 
having a look. Sometimes we get in a rut, don't we, when we're um, when we're beading, trying to come up with some new design ideas. My problem is I'll come up with something and then have a look around and somebody's already come up with a similar idea. She's like, for goodness sake, I never get in first. <laughs> Very rarely. Um, and again, five sets of little clasps and some lobster clasps. So toggle clasps and lobster clasps. I'm absolutely made up. And again, with the hair accessories, if you want to do some wire wrapping with the crocodile clips. Wow, I'm really impressed. So, there we go then guys. This is my bead haul from AliExpress.com. I will put all the links to the goodies that I've received underneath the video so please remember to have a look have a look in the description bar if you'd like to um, take a look at Aliexpress I will try and put a link to the whole website as well as well as the um, items that I'm showing you today so there we are silver essential findings kit a gold essential finding kit Let's widen you out a wee bit so I can try and put it all on. Move all this rubbish over the way a bit. <laughs> um, this is another great kit. With guys in mind, with the pliers, with the long nose pliers, the little um, tweezers. God, I can't get my words out. Jumper ring opener. The... 0.6 elastic thread as well as all the beads so we've got that and we've also got the box of metal beads in antique silver so wow well, we've got that we've got the needles and the amethyst coloured glass beads with those gorgeous hearts and some small bugle beads and some seed beads and the big eyed needles and for the children maybe pinch these <laughs> no Jane don't be naughty um, we'll have to see if we can come up with something for those shells it's a shame that they, they won't get threaded on but maybe there's another way of doing it um, I'll have to have a look and a think and see if I can come up with something with the lobster clasps and everything all in, all in there I can't, that is a great way to get the children involved and the children started with an interest or a little hobby to do on a rainy day. So there we are then guys. I really do hope that you've enjoyed um, this little bead haul video from AliExpress.com. Please do remember to go and check them out. Um, if you're new to my channel, um, please think about subscribing. It's free! It's free! What do we get in this world for free? Not a lot. So while away a, a few hours watching uh, some of my videos. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. And it helps my videos to get seen. Little thumb, 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 thumb. <laughs> and obviously if you'd like to drop me a comment. I'd love to hear, hear your thoughts and hear about you and what you're up to. Um, so I appreciate that as well. So from me today then, with some beading ideas in mind, have a wonderful day. And until next time, take good care of yourself, stay safe and stay well. Let's see those thumbs guys. Thumbs, thumbs. Thumbs, thumbs, thumbs. <laughs> see you soon.